oriented strand board and this uses uh, wood flakes which are removed by a kind of a, a planing operation from, uh, from logs and uh, these flakes look something like this and with OSB production uh, the flakes are oriented in some way you make some attempt to get them all pointing in the same direction but it's not perfect so you end up with a sort of patterned effect which for some reason is completely beyond me some people find decorative um, I just think it's a functional material myself um, and these layers of flakes are built up uh, we use phenyl formaldehyde resin which is sprayed onto the surface of the flakes and uh, the board is pressed and we end up with oriented strand board as a consequence so that will then be sawn to length, sawn to width and the surface may or may not be sanded um, it isn't necessarily a requirement because I'd say this isn't really a product that uh, is designed to be aesthetically pleasing uh, it's a product that's designed to be functional uh, but the good thing about this, one of the big advantages of phenol formaldehyde resin and the use in oriented strand board is that it does make it waterproof waterproof so it can be used for exterior applications, it's relatively cheap so you see a lot of this used to fill up holes in walls like if people have got broken windows they'll put a bit of this in there but it also can be used structurally um, there are on the market products which use uh, a wood element top and bottom and in between there is a piece of oriented strand board these are called eye joists so I think you can work out why they're called eye joists and they use in structural applications in buildings you can build large panels out of these um, OSB panels by saying large panels I mean you can build up what are called structural panels and uh, they quite often come under the category of SIPs structural insulated panels in which case you have uh, two of these OSB panels like that and in between there you have a layer of insulation foam which is usually polyurethane foam so these are very light and they're very stiff and strong structures so they have found a lot of use in construction so um, OSB panels are very much used in construction applications